Okay. Let's get down to business. Hello, everyone. I'm Mitchell Ryan Darcy, and welcome to MRD Unbox. This is my first Magic the Gathering related video that I have done on this YouTube channel. And to celebrate, I tracked down a brand new Avacyn Restored Fat Pack. Brand new, wrapped all that jazz. And I got it for dirt cheap, especially the fact that uh, this fat pack came out about five years ago. And so, there's not many around left, I think. Well, from what I can tell in southern Ontario, it's, there's not that many left. So, I am super excited to open this up. Uh, I don't know, well, well, I might as well tell you this now, but... I have a certain rule when it comes to fat packs. I don't want to get more than one of the same set because it's kind of pointless unless it's totally on sale, uh, in my opinion. But, um, I mean, the box is pretty cool depending on the set. But um, I generally try to just get one of each set. And so when I started playing Magic the Gathering in the early, what was it? ending of Dragon Maze, beginning of Pharos. Um, that's when I started playing Magic for the first time. I was able to track down around that time a Innistrad and Dark Ascension fat pack, but I never got around to tracking down an Avacyn Restored fat pack. So there you go. I finally got the completed tri trilogy or trinity or whatever you would call it of the fat packs. So, let me just adjust my focus. Uh, it's my first time doing a video like this, so I want to make sure everything is looking nice using a foil river hoopoo. Okay, let's get down to business and open this pack. I want to be careful. Let's see if my nail can get through. Oh, there we go. It's opened. It's been a while since I've looked at Avacyn Restored or that whole Innistrad block card. So really the only thing I am I remember in the set is uh, I think Avacyn's in here, obviously. I mean, her name's on the box. Um, I don't know if I'll be, I'll get her. That's going to be the interesting part. Foil one would be nice, but... Kind of doubt it. There we go. Boom. Oh, feel that new cardboard feel. Even smells good. Let's get down. down, down. Stop singing, Mitchell. Okay. Oh, man, that looks so good with the gold. It's the Avison Restored Player's Guide. And... You're probably very familiar with this if you've ever bought one of these uh, fat packs. Uh, yeah, can't wait to look that over. Um, boo, 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 later on. I'm not going to do that in the video, obviously. So let's get down to business. Ba, ba, ba. I'm repeating myself. Oh, okay. Open this up. Beautiful. Avison box. Really nice looking box. Uh, there we go. Got the land. Boosters. Only nine boosters. Oh, we got a green die for uh, Avacyn Restored. Then you got these uh, crappy things. I just build them anyways. I use them as like uh, uh, dividers for my cards. Empty little space fillers because uh, they didn't really build the cases big enough for sleeved cards, unfortunately. Boom, more garbage. Okay, let's open up this pack. Wow, die just came out real easy. Oh, it's green with a little bit of blue, so that's that's cool. Boom, yeah, open this. Don't want to destroy the boosters, Mitchell. We want to save the boosters, Mitchell. Boop, 
boom, boom, boom. Got that little player guide thing. Okay, so boosters are out. Let's move this box off to the side. Okay. Rapid fire, rapid fire. Boom, boom, boom. I really need to bring scissors next time. Oh my gosh. Number one thing I forget to do for an unboxing video is scissors. Knife. Anything. Sharp. Okay. There we go. Lands. Boom. We're not going to open the lands. Keep that sealed. I got enough lands. Okay. Boom. Boosters. Start off with the one with the package with the die. And uh, shall we begin? Here we go. I don't recognize that card. It's... Once again, I just want to irritate, not irritate, uh, reiterate that I'm actually not that good of a Magic Gathering player. But I do my best and I have fun. And isn't that what the matters? No, that's not what matters. Money, money, value, collecting, that's what matters. Who, who plays Magic the Gathering for fun? No one does that. It's not like it's a toy or anything. Oh, let's get commons. Uh, I'm, I'm, my memory is starting to come back to me. Um, cool. Then make a common section over there. Okay, so we get Stone Right. Uh, Commanders of Forty, Reign of Thorns, and Angel of Glory Rise. I have enough of her. Promo and Avacyn version. <laughs> oh well. One down, eight to go. Forest. Nice forest. Who cares? Boom, boom, boom. Next pack, uh, oh, what's his name? Is that T Tabor? I don't know how to pronounce it. Tibor, the devil, devil planeswalker, <laughs> or he looks like the devil. <laughs> I don't know. Did I just assume his uh, species? <laughs> um, oh yeah, I remember that guy. I remember a lot of these. Another stone, right? Uh, but we got a demotic uh, taskmaster and appetite for the brains. Cool, cool, cool. And a Harvester of Souls. A nice spirit token. And land. Boom. That's great. That's uh, decent. Pretty good. I don't know. Technically, I probably already lost value. But, you know, you never know what the next booster has. No, I, I don't really care that much of the value of the cards. I just, uh... I, I like playing Magic the Gathering. I like building my own deck. I mean, it would be nice to build a really good deck that wins. Oh, yeah. I should have opened that in front of the camera. Op Did I just open the booster off camera? Wow, I just pulled these cards out. Yeah, yeah it's, it's sketchy. This video is sketchy. Never watch this guy again for Magic the Gathering. He has fakes. These are all fakes. Not very good fakes, but... Um, Vigilant Justice, Second Guess, and Lightning Marauder. And, oh! Our first mythic, it's Sigarda, Host of Heroines. Ah, she's the one that wept for her sisters in the new Innistrad block. Cool, cool, cool. Awesome. Mythic flying hex proof. A winning combination, I might add. Um, okay, let's open the booster in front of the camera, Mitchell. Uh, let's open this booster in front of the camera, Mitchell. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what we got here. Boom. I don't remember this being a really big set, so... Okay. 
Uncommons. We got a Druid's Familiar. Cool. Into the Void. Archangel and a Restoration Angel. Woo! Decent, I think. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below if I got uh, complete garbage or this is actually a pretty winning fat pack. So far I got one mythic, so that's, I think, pretty good for a fat pack. Because that's like the average fat pack, I assume. Uh, maybe. I've gotten fat packs before with no mythics. They're sad. Sad fat packs, but... Oh, man. Moreland Inquisitor! Boom, boom, boom. Ah, uh, like that art. Dead waters. Uh, boop, boop, do. Cool. Oh, am I going to the... Okay, common. Okay. Dave out. Champ... Champlain? I don't know. I'm, I'm really good at butchering names. So, Lightning Prowess and Homicidal Seclusion. And then our rare is Un... Ovald Tracker. Cool, cool, cool. I think it's cool. I don't know if it's totally cool. One cost, one one, and then for two you can target creature you could all fights on our target creature. That's that's pretty good, I think. Boom boom boom. Boom, boom, boom. Equipment. I always need more equipment for my equipment commander deck. It's, all these commons are going out of control. Uh, second guess. Ghostly touch and, once again, homicidal uh, seclusion. And our rare. Ooh, I've never seen this one before. Otherworld Atlas. Four costs. Put a charge counter on it, and then tap. Each player draws a card for each charge counter on Otherworld Atlas. Oh, pretty interesting rare. Cool. I like it. I like it indeed. Down to the last free boosters. Let's see what else we get. Haven't got a single foil yet. Maybe that's all about the change. Crypt Creeper, Dangerous Wine, blah blah blah, Cloud Shift, Abundant Growth. Oh, Blood Artist! Yeah! Love that art. Uh, Devout Champion, Tantan Look, and our rare is. Oh, damn it, we got the, the intro deck rare. Damn it. Hey, a foil rare! Druid's Repository! Yes! Ah, uh, because the, the, I, I got this in a fat pack once, and the, um, some of the, uh, there's an error with the printing, um, it's like faded in one little spot, so you can barely read it one, in one area. So now I got a really good looking foil version of it. That is awesome. Awesome. I have no idea if the card's that good. Uh, let's see, whenever a creature you control attacks, put a charge counter on it, remove a charge counter. Yeah, I guess that's good. I mean, it does what green does. Gives you lots of mana for lots of creatures, you know? Oh, that's awesome. Absolutely. I'm going to put that next to the mythics. Oh, yeah. Do to do. Token, human, uh, crappy lone reverent. But that foil made it, made that pack so much more better. Let's see what else we got. There we go. Four. Keep this in focus, Mitchell. This might be, without a doubt, the worst uh, unboxing video for in the history of Magic the Gathering. Not because of the cards, but because of the person operating the fucking camera. I don't have autofocus, guys. I manually do this shit, okay? I'm a filmmaker. Oh, we've been reforged the soul. Uh, 
not amazing, but I think it's pretty good. It's boom. But uh, favorite wins, Triumph of the Ferocity. Uh, butcher that. And this is it. The last pack is uh, Grizzlebane in here. Probably not. It's yeah. I think wasn't Grizzlebane in one of the other sets, or was he in Evison? I can't remember. Uh, let's find out. Boom! Final pack. Battle him. Nature's end. Fleeting distraction. Abundant growth. Angels Murphy. Uh, Fatchet revolt. Diagraph escort. Seraph sanctuary. Undead executioner. Oh, uh, don't reveal the rare. Uh, Skakin drift. Drake. Whatever. Potato, patata, put this here. Oh, I think we might have got foil. I'm not sure. Feels like there's a lot of cards here. Rush of Blood, Angel's Tomb, and Descendant's Path. I have never seen this card before. Look at that art. Holy crap, that's like a collage. What is this ability of this? At the beginning of your upkeep, reveal the top card of your library. If it's a creature card that shares a creature type with a creature you control, you may cast that card while paying its mana cost. Otherwise, put that card on the bottom of your library. Oh my gosh. Free cost enchantment. With that ability and that, that is amazing. I would love to see what this looks like foil. Holy crap. That's amazing. Yeah, okay, so I didn't get a foil. But I got one foil, and the foil was a rare of one that I needed another of. So that is that is pretty good. We got one mythic, which is pretty like standard for a fat pack, uh, if you're lucky. I think the most I ever got from a fat pack was free mythics, but uh, yeah, some crap cards, but some some good ones and some that I don't have so that's awesome I can't wait to add to the collection this that is that is amazing like I want a play mat of lad art that that looks wow who who designed that that's uh Teris Nielsen really really good job on the art man I mean most Magic the Gathering cards have nice art so that's really nice and then we got just here to write foil awesome Drew's repository and our mythic let's not destroy the mythic this is this is how you destroy mythics Mitchell Sigarda <laughs> host of heroines 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 yeah. Awesome. Pretty awesome fat pack. And I'm glad I was able to. I now have all three fat packs for the original Innistrad block. And I actually also have the fat packs for the newer Innistrad block as well. So. Awesome. Focus. So I want everyone to have a nice day. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Like this video if you want. Uh, yeah, it's entirely up to you if you want to like this video or subscribe or, you know, you know, that normal YouTube stuff. Have a nice day and um, may the river hoopoo be with you always.